University Akron Tournament, Syracuse on Friday, and number four in defending national champion Akron on Sunday afternoon. What's your reaction to, to receiving the national award? That had to have been pretty good. Uh, you know, I just heard about it this morning. It was, it's nice to get that recognition, but I feel like that's definitely a, a more so a team honor because, I mean, obviously I didn't do that by myself. They made it really, really easy for me. Um, so, you know, it's nice, but uh, I'll take it. I'll take it for what it's worth, for sure. What's going right? Because from my count, you guys have allowed two goals this season. Am I right on that? Yep. What What's going right with the defense and, and with yourself? You know, they're just really meshing well. We've got some good veteran players. Um, things are just kind of starting to fall into place. Hopefully they'll continue to go that way. Um, that's That's about it. What makes you guys a good defense? What, what kinds of things do you do that, that make you good? You know, we all have good relationships with one another. We kind of know. We've been playing with each, with each other for long enough to kind of know, you know, how somebody else is going to react in a certain situation and uh, that sort of thing. So it's, you know, it's one of those relationships where you kind of, you know, when this guy is going to maybe uh, falter a little bit, you know, where you have to pick up the slack or, you know, vice versa. You guys have kind of gotten to the cusp of being like really nationally relevant, and you know, but you haven't really been able to break through the glass. This weekend is an opportunity to do that against the, you know, the Syracuse and of course Akron. You know, right. Talk about talk about maybe the, the team's readiness to kind of take that next step. You know, I I think uh, this weekend, this past weekend, was a really good warm up for that. Uh, we played some real good competition uh, in West Virginia and. Uh, with Villanova, you know, two also nationally ranked programs. Uh, so I think that'll give us a good, you know, sort of footing on, on where we should look to step up to for these next two programs. Do you know anything about Syracuse or Akron yet? Um, no, we don't. We, we know that Akron's obviously last year's national champions and they're always a great program. Uh, as far as Syracuse, I don't personally know a whole lot about it. Uh, you know, we'll we'll be getting our scouting reports from our coaches and stuff, and I'm sure we'll be <laughs> well educated by the time we face them. But uh, as of now, not yet. Yeah, Patrick, Bill said that you guys have only allowed two goals, but you guys have only scored three goals this year. This so I mean, it, 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 uh, it, it seems like that's going to put a little pressure on you. And do you feel any pressure to you know, keep those balls out of the net? Um, Extra pressure, I guess. I mean, extra pressure, no. It's pretty much the same consistent pressure. Uh, you know, I always want to get the shutout. So does, so does my defense, so does my midfield. You know, up to the forwards, everybody's defending in order to, you know, to get that shutout, get those results. So, you know, our philosophy is if we can, and, you know, at least shut every team out, then, you know, we'll, we'll have a, a good chance to win every game. Because, I mean, that, that makes it so we only need to put one in the back of the net instead of two or three, which is considerably easier I suppose any frustration uh, you can you can tell that with the guys that you guys haven't been able to break through and, and put a couple and two three goals in a, in a game you know we're frustrated uh, at times you know games like the last one where you're you're running for 110 minutes and you don't have much to show for it uh, you know we really felt like we uh, pressured uh, West Virginia very well and you know showed very well against that nationally ranked program but we, didn't, we just obviously didn't have the goal to show for it. And so, you know, that'll put strain on any program, honestly. Uh, but, you know, we feel that, you know, as soon as one of them comes, more are going to come. Hopefully those floodgates will open and, you know, some guys that have knocks and whatnot get healthy and we can start sticking the ball in the back of the net. <laughs> you, you had a five-game homestand. You went 2-1-2. Two, and two. You know, not bad, not great. I mean, are you, are you kicking yourself, you know, no pun intended, that, that you didn't, you know, you didn't, uh, you know, win four, you know, three, four, five games? You know, it's, it's one of those things where right now, you know, it might not seem that important, but you know, come playoff time, you know, when they're looking for wild cards or whatnot, it's, uh, you know, those are the ones we're going to look back on and be like, man, I wish we could have put a ball in the back of the net that game. So, uh, you know, not kicking ourselves too hard right now, but hopefully that won't be the case at the end of the season, you know. <laughs> You're talking about wild cards or at large. I mean, you know, a win at Akron would, would go a long ways. I mean, talk about the opportunity of, 
playing the national champs and, and really, you know, if you guys were to win, it would be just a, a landmark win in the history of this program. Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. Um, you know, obviously Syracuse is first, and yeah. that's what we're we're trying to focus on at this point. Uh, I hate to use the cliche one game at a time, but you know, it's it's very true. <laughs> well, since we're not going to see you in between games, just just if you can talk about the the, the challenge and uh, uh, the difficulty of playing, you know, Akron. You know, we're. We've seen close to that sort of competition, but obviously we haven't seen them personally yet. So, uh, you know, there'll be adversity no matter what, and hopefully we can respond to that. You know, we have we have good players, we have a good team. Uh, you know, we're we're hoping to react the best.